let's start with the reading Libra. This reading is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus sign. Keep in mind that the energies go both ways. So feel free to interpret the direction of the messages as the best resonate with your own personal situation. Also, I am selecting people for free personal readings. I do so every week. If you need one, just keep watching to know how to get selected. Now, let's see what messages we have for you today. Okay. So, very interesting. Ah, it makes sense. What you're seeing right here is someone who is definitely doing a 180. We see the first card at the bottom of the deck, the Eight of Cups reversed. And obviously, at some point, this card was upright. That's how it came up. And what you have experienced when this card was upright was someone who has left. Someone who has gave up on you, perhaps. Who has stopped trying or decided not to try to fix the situation. Right here, you see someone who is saying out loud, you know what, this is, this is not for me. This is, I need something else. I need something more positive. Something um, more light. Something easier. And overall, they just left. They just let go. And this was definitely a hard time for you. We'll see right there soon why. But it's important to see how this card now is reversed. Look who is realizing now what mistake they have made by walking away. Obviously, with the Six of Cups following this card, we have someone who is really feeling nostalgic right now. They're missing you. They're revisiting the past and their own actions. They are realizing that the reason why they feel the way they feel today, it's because of their own actions. They're thinking, what have I, everything that I've done up to this point brought me here and I'm not happy. How do I change this? This person is definitely feeling still very somewhat affectionate towards you. They have these memories and they keep perhaps looking at pictures. I definitely see here someone who is looking at pictures of you first thing in the morning and then right before going to bed as well. I see that they are perhaps a little mad, a little angry at themselves because they close themselves out of this beautiful situation, this beautiful door, which hides a treasure, you, hides an opportunity that right now they just want to go back to. That's very, very simple right there, actually. Now, what we see in the middle of the reading is actually something very important for you to know, because in order to overall understand how the situation would evolve if you were to consider any sort of reconciliation with this person, you need to understand where they're coming from. And this is why right here in the middle of the reading, there is something that might have happened to them, uh, some sort of uh, disappointment, breakup. They feel very weak right now. And they are uh, thinking that the only person, the only energy that even just at the idea of it gives them stability and happiness. It's still you, Libra. They're thinking, I, I let go of the only person that was going to really be there for me. And I just treat it like something that I could have found somewhere else. Whereas instead, that was the treasure with the Five of Pentacles. That was something that I should have protected and nurtured. And instead... I just behave like a selfish person and perhaps, you know what, I don't even deserve it. This person right now is feeling very weak. They might be experiencing some sort of depression or loneliness and they find comfort in looking at pictures of you. That's, that's all. But that's, of course, 
something that it's not it's not stable it's not something that can last a long time eventually it has to transform into actions or into words messages we'll see how this energy is going to evolve in the near future but overall what we see right here with the six of swords is definitely you in your past position you have a situation where you're forced to having to deal with something that you didn't want to deal with you know with the six of swords a painful transition a time where you had to let go of attachments and start anew and this for you uh, seeing the six of swords perhaps wasn't easy it wasn't a it wasn't your first choice overall you would have uh, tried a little bit more you would have uh, fought a little harder but you know you're a Libra, you're a strong sign, you're a fighter, you're a go-getter, and you are that type of person that whenever you see something important, you are not, you're not going to just let it drift away from you. And so right here with the Six of Swords, we see how that situation perhaps changed. Your perception, your the way you overall felt towards love maybe also in general and here you might be thinking you know what it's time to focus on me it's time to bring myself that stability and that balance that obviously other people cannot bring to me but what i love about you and your approach is it's how we see here that you're going from a past position of just losing faith in everything and in love especially so instead, going to another place currently or very soon in the future where you're going to think, you know what, I can still have it all. That right there is just an obstacle. It's just a challenge along the way in my journey. But it's not the outcome. It's the outcome only if I stop fighting, if I stop trying. Therefore, I'm just going to keep going because I know that I can have it all. And you know what? You have this vision of the Ten of Pentacles right here, which talks about having it all. The family, the stability, the happiness, uh, the confidence, of it all, everything that you can ask for. And what you see right here that is that coming up towards you, there is a beautiful opportunity, a new seed showing up into your environment, which is going to grow into this Ten of Pentacles. And it looks absolutely beautiful. But... Before getting there, before seeing what is coming up towards you, a very important message right here with the Ten of Swords and the Three of Pentacles. Right now, your strength is into dealing with the situation, with this cycle that needs to come to an end. I think Sagittarius had a similar card, maybe the Ten of Swords in the strength position as well. Overall, what this is talking about is focusing on the truth you know not trying to justify maybe certain people because of certain things that they cannot give you or thinking that they're going to change in the future uh, right here it's very important for you to go straight to the point and surround yourself just with the people who have the same values and the same goals that you have perhaps for some of you out there this person who at some point left was someone who you knew was not ready for a long-term commitment. Maybe you, you had the hope that this could have evolved into that beautiful Ten of Pentacles, into that beautiful connection. But chances are that some signs around you were already telling you, listen, Libra, this is not someone who now is ready for a long-term commitment and maybe you are expecting things that this person is not going to give you but you have faith you had a vision and you always do as a libra and it's beautiful i like that you fight for these things and now the message is you still have to fight for these things but you have to surround yourself with the people who want to fight the same fight that you want to invest into that you want to focus on and so right here with the three of pentacles supporting these messages 
it's a clear energy saying you are going look at this you're going soon to meet someone or to see someone coming back we'll see who that is who now has the same vision and sees you as this precious element this precious person that they are they will never be able to find again in their life and so this is a pivotal time a turning point for you and it comes up only if you realize that you have to be true to yourself libra i know that you believe in people you want to believe in people and you can still do that but at the same time your expectations your needs need to be met and they can be met just from the people with the people who know how important certain things are now we see how this person is definitely coming back i was talking about it earlier the eight of cups reverse we see a 180 someone who was walking away and now is just coming back is this the person who's bringing you this ace of pentacles or is this someone new you know when you see the ace of pentacles you know that you have the potential for something absolutely beautiful this is the reward for everything you you've had to go through also this talks about loyalty it talks about someone who's going to be honest and transparent about their intentions and this is something that can grow into what into this ten of pentacles right there exactly what you wanted and were looking for so this is going to be a time for you to prioritize the things that are important to you and then act who is bringing this ace of pentacles to you let's see who this person is going to be is it this one who eventually is going to come back but we'll still have to see with what type of energy or is it someone new someone who sees you for who you really are who appreciates you and sees your value and it's not going to um miss out on that opportunity to be with someone so special as you libra so let's look into this ace of pentacles let's see what you should expect in the near future who is bringing that pentacle to you that new beginning and how overall it's going to shape your near and distant future as well if you want to dive deeper into the messages libra just follow me in the extended reading link below in the description box also don't forget that every week i randomly select viewers who have watched the extended video to offer them a free personal 30 minute reading i send out emails every monday morning to confirm make sure to check out your spam folder as well now stay tuned for the extended preview coming right up after this welcome back to your extended reading libra now what we have seen in this situation is someone who left too quickly and who right now realizes that you were worth the fight you were worth the work the effort that they should have put in into this in order to just ensure that they did everything that they could have done in order to make this successful but we see how quickly they just walked away and right now they are coming back they are missing you in a way that they were not anticipating in a way that actually we see it right here with the 10 of cups the 9 of swords they feel so anxious and so worried that they truly lost you and to me this is really something that function like a switch they were fine and then at some point they seen something from you a picture they've heard something about you and all of a sudden they realize oh my god i'm still in love with that person what have i done why didn't i try more i i like him i i, I still feel that love why do i still feel that love and so this is just a journey back to you they're trying to find a way back to you and we see someone with the ace of pentacles but we cannot see their face we cannot see who this person is going to be you have a vision and this is your first step in to the journey that will take you there to that 10 of pentacles now let's see who is bringing that ace of pentacles let's see what type of energies and what you should expect in the near future
Okay. Oh, well. You can see here who this person is going to be. And overall, these cards right here truly talk about someone who is...